All right, so we have this uh, Mac board here. It's for a MacBook Pro. Uh, we just got done washing it in our alcohol solution, and we're actually going to let it sit in here so uh, it can dry out. Um, one thing you have to do is make sure that it's completely dry and completely clean before you uh, go and start doing anything to it. So we're going to let this sit for maybe 15 15-20 uh, minutes and then we're going to go from there to the reflow process to see what we can get done. So now that our board is dried, uh, we're actually going to reflow um, the back chip, which we've already done, the middle chip, and this coprocessor right here, but we do not touch this one. This one right here, you do not touch. That's a processor. So there's no reason to reflow that processor at all, but what we're going to do is allow this to uh, do its process and we'll see what happens from it and where it goes. Alright, so we have our board <coughs> taken off the uh, heat plate. Uh, we just finished our uh, reflow and we're going to let it cool down. Uh, in this case, our user uh, hasn't said anything for us to uh, test it out with, just a basic reflow. So what we're going to do is uh, just take it from here and put it in a box and ship it out along with all the other stuff that's going out today. So um, hopefully we'll be able to take this and say it's complete, but we'll have to wait on our customer to get back to us to see if that's the case. So this one we're going to say is being held right now so we'll see what it does and where it goes